What's going on guys? It's Time Zone welcoming you back to the next episode of our Super Mario Odyssey Let's Play Blind. We are here in Bowser's Kingdom. Back at the beginning, I was just uh, wandering around in another save file for a little bit. Um, doing different things, checking out different stuff, and we are going to be going right back to where we left off in the last episode. Um, now that we're back- ah, oh, shoot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There's nine. There's nine Goombas exactly, so I can't even do that ten Goomba thing this time. That was a total mistake. Total screw up on my part. <laughs> my bad, guys, but uh, let's just take this time to move on. And I really like the uh, the new sound effect that that electricity has in this kingdom. That's really cool. That is that is tray cool. Can we do something here? Let's just go up this way. No! No! That's okay. That is okay. Alright. Jump here. I do I do want to do this. I want to jump up this way. I want to jump up this way. Boom, boom, boom. Get rid of this guy. And... Uh... What's this down here? Oh, there's a moon! There is a moon! Alright, cool. Behind the big wall. The great wall? Wrong country. Wrong country. Gain some knowledge time zone. Gain some... Game... Game some knowledge? We are on a roll today. We are on a roll! I love climbing... Ah. Oh. No! Oh, okay, thank god. Okay, that was... That was inevitable. I was gonna get hit by that guy. Let's hear some of this. Very cool. Alright, we're back. We're back to where we were last episode. I'm just looking for a heart. I don't even care about them coins. What is this? This is like a... This is like a giant thwomp. Right? Oh! Okay. Go up here. And... Oh, I'm stuck. I got stuck. I got stuck. we will just... I thought that was- this seems like an insta-kill, guys. That's heavy. That is some heavy bombardment. Oh, and that's how we get the moon. Okay. So we did have to kill the guy. We have to kill him. And it's a main moon. This is a main mission. Infiltrate Bowser's castle. We done. We done infiltrating. We infiltrated all that. Another coffee. Another Sunday, another coffee. This is planned to go up on a Tuesday, so I'm gonna ask you guys, how was your Monday? How was your weekend in general? How's the last couple days been? It is the 4th of uh, 5th of December. <laughs> it is the 5th of December when this is going up. Almost one week in, and this year has passed by so quickly, so quickly. I might be doing a little bit of a, uh, just a one-on-one -on -one kind of update video asking you guys what you're most interested in after Odyssey is near completion, after Shantae is much more down the road. Uh, just kind of like catching up with you guys one-on-one, -on -one, having a little bit of a discussion, telling you about my own story a little bit, um, stuff like that. How did that even start? How did that conversation even start? That started because... Uh, I was gonna say that this year is going by so quickly, and... Is there anything there? Is this just coins? Just coin nonsense? I don't even need these coins. This guy is sitting on something here. Nothing. Okay. It's only been about seven, uh, se ten months. Nine months. It's only been about nine months since I've been in LA, actually. So my time here has flown by, and it's only been about, what, a month and a half that I've been doing this LP? So, or doing an LP at all, starting a, starting a YouTube channel, it's been like a month and a half of me doing that. So it's super cool how quickly time flew by, and I'm really happy about uh, what happened in that amount of time. So, just a little moment of reflection, it's like reflection zone here, a little reflection zone. Okay, so we're back here. <laughs> we are back here after our reflecting and flying off the edge of Bowser's kingdom. Just trying to get these purples. And this is a 100 purple kingdom. So even though uh, it looked just like a couple of islands, 
uh, leading up to one larger place. This is a large kingdom. Look, there's more purples there. The purples, purples everywhere. There are purples and purples and perps. Perps and purples. And yeah, I'm just gonna fall in front of this giant rolling bomb rock. That's cool. Get, get out of here. I already picked my bird. I already picked my bird. I'm good to go. I'm good to go for now. So there's these things, obviously. Uh, these moon shards. Got one of them. Got two of them. I cannot jump up there. Let's see what else we got over here. Anything. Oh, there's definitely a moon in there. Can I? Oh, okay. I can poke these things. Get out! Don't you bother me like that. There is a piece. I thought that was going to be a moon. I was hoping that was going to be a moon all on its own, but it ain't. But it chained. Okay, uh, I want to check out what's down there real quick. Real quick like. Also, what's up here, honestly, real quick like. Uh, looks like we can jump up this way. Okay. Cool. That's what it sounds like when you fling. Sounds like Okay. Moon! Did not realize I was going to be here. Treasure inside the turret. This is a turret? This is a giant turret here. I still have not got my glasses fixed. It's been like three weeks since I mentioned that. In my Super Mario Odyssey Let's Play. Okay, there's number four. And we're almost there. We're almost there, guys. Number four. Grab that with Cappy. Cappy helped me out a little bit over there. Cappy! Cappy, take the wheel! It looks like I need to go down there to collect those purples with one of these burbs. Let's go, burb! Got him. Got him. He's got a little stash going on. How do I get up? How do I get up there? Uh, can I? I'll have to go up here. Okay. This is going to be a climb. A climb and a half. I'm going to speed this up real quick. Check it out right here. Don't frown, guys. Don't be sad. Don't be sad about things in life. Just make, make it, make it, make it happy. See what, see what's sad. Make it happy. See what's sad. Make it, make it happy. That's my motto. That's my motto in life. That's today's quote of the day, for real. Here we go. Bam! Got him. Got him. Just had a little. Need, need, you gotta, you gotta use a little tenacity. A little. <laughs> All right, had to edit that out because that was not a pleasant sound for anybody to be hearing. Not a pleasant sound for anyone to hear. Okay. We just need to find this last moon shard. Where it's at. Where it's at. There's more purples down there. My goodness, this is a really large kingdom. This is a really large kingdom. I'm starting to realize. Can we just dive down here and... Oh, nope, we cannot. It looks like we will need the bird. We need the bird to grab those. Uh, but you know what? It's too hard. It's too hard. I can't do it. And I don't have the bird with me to get back up top. So I'm just going to have to... Dive. Dive out of here. Okay. So let's climb up this, and there it is. There's the last. There's the last moon shard. The opposite direction of where we were going before. Grab those thirty. I wonder what the shop guys are gonna look like. Uh, the shop over here is gonna be really interesting. What are the people of this kingdom? They might just be robots, maybe. Is there like a? I don't know if there's a default shop character. I know that the that in what was it called? In Cascade Kingdom, the shop people were not the actual uh, residents of the kingdom, but they were the caps. They were like Cappy. And I totally forgot where that moon showed up. Uh, where do I go to get that moon that I just got the shards for? I don't know. Okay, so it's right here. It's right here. I uh, just had to come back up this cannon area and pick this moon up, and it's clearly another step in our main quest, which I'm hoping 
Uh, we can finish up before uh, the boss battle of this world in this episode. You might need one more of these uh, main quest moons before we move on. I guess. I guess. Big brutal battle. Okay, so this is going to be definitely a repeat of one of the brutals. I think we fought all of them already so far. Cascade Kingdom had this weird woman with her chain chomp, her gold chomp, and I did not see her on the ship, so I don't know where she came from. But uh, that's a thing, apparently. So there might be other brutals that we haven't seen on the ship. Oh, look. Oh, here's the, here's the store. Okay, very cool. Here is the store. Souvenir shop. Really curious about what... What is this? There's three and then there's two. This is definitely some kind of... Uh, am I supposed to stand here? Is this me? Is this me, guys? Maybe I need to get this outfit and then come over here. Is this a person? Okay. Better be dressed for battle, my friend. Don't look like a samurai. True? True, I don't look like a samurai in the least. Let's go in here. It might be people, it might be regular denizens of New Donk, yep. Buy this, of course. Look at all these new items. Have we not seen any of those new clothes from the yellow coin shop yet? Shopping at Bowser's Castle. Look at this. Oh, oh, oh my god. Pirate outfit and a clown outfit. And of course the boxer shorts. Look at this, pirate hat, yar. But they're plundering cargo or burying treasure. You're gonna need an extremely fancy coat. Mechanic cap. This is sick, I definitely want the pirate outfit. I want the pirate outfit for sure, look at this. This is bad mmm. A bad mmm outfit. The clown thing is gonna be so funny, but I'm gonna wait until another kingdom to put that on, because that makes no darn sense to put on in here and this pirate outfit is going to have a very short-lived life because we're about to see the samurai outfit and it is dope happy happy headband just a bit of your head traditional clothing this is so sick is this like what those um i've definitely seen people wearing this kind of garb at festivals and parades and stuff like that that's amazing sticker jizo statue Okay, that is expensive. 25 purples. We're getting the samurai stuff right now. I'm gonna get this right now and change into it right now. Change into it right now. Let's go. I do kind of like this though, the sticker. It's like little cards. 10. Oh, we can afford it. We're gonna grab it. We're gonna grab it, guys. We need more stickers on our Odyssey. We're gonna need more stickers. A lamp can wait, I think. We might come back here. I know that I've been missing out on a lot of the shops in each of the other kingdoms we've been to because I'm just so pumped to see what's going on there, beat the boss and whatnot, and then move on to the next one. Oh, there's purples right inside this, this place right here. So we can crawl here, grab these, and then roll right out. Now we can get in here though. Now I look like a samurai. Yes, I do, sir. I wonder what the thing is going to be. What would I have to do? Is it like sword practice? Is it like fighting? Okay. Can I knock this thing over? What is this? What is wall jumping here going to do for me? Oh, this... I don't know. I don't know what this is. Let's check it out. Oh, this is sick. This is sick. Alright, I'm gonna grab these, and then... I just love how in the 2D sections they... Oh, this is so cool, the... It's like, uh, those... When people have these paper wall things to change behind and stuff like that. Oh! Got excited. I got too excited about that. Very cool. Yeah, I love that they have the outfits show up in the 2D sections as well. And there's a bird, there's an art, there's an art, there's some art of the birds that we were possessing and using their beaks for. That is so pretty. I love the color scheme too, the like yellow and it just matches with the brown and everything. It just is so aesthetic. Alright, alright, alright. And now we have a musical notes section. Uh, can, maybe I can use 
Maybe I can use this guy for the musical notes, but maybe not. Also just thought that was gonna kill me right there. Okay, get this. Boom. Get this here. Get this. Boom. Boom, biggity bam bop. Here we go. That was not a problem at all. Taking notes in the folding screen, that's what it is. A folding a screen. Guys, Japan is somewhere I've wanted to go for so long, and one of my good friends actually had just come back from a two-week trip to Japan. She said it was absolutely incredible, showed me some gorgeous pictures of the place, and brought me back Japanese-flavored Kit Kats. Not flavored as Japanese people, but flavored as green tea. Okay. Okay, okay, fine, fine. I'll take it. I'll take it. Can I- can I get in? Oh my goodness, alright. Okay, let's try this again. Let's try not to be silly about it this time, though. Here we go. Oh, we were- we were- we were a bit silly about it. We were a bit silly, there we go. I think that's good. That's good! We got it, okay. Yeah, flavored with green tea, black tea, strawberry, like strawberry cheesecake, apple flavored. It is ridiculous the kinds of flavorings they have on those Kit Kats, and they're so tasty. They're all so tasty, and it actually tastes like, it's like jelly beans almost. You know how jelly beans just can get some ridiculous flavors nowadays? And it just seems right, almost? That's what those Kit Kats were like. So, anyways. <laughs> anyways! Oh, uh, what is this? Can I do something here? I can nay, I can nay do something here. Maybe after I beat the level, there'll be something to do around these parts. But for now, we are moving on fourth. Oh my goodness, this area is huge. Look at this, and it's beautiful. It is beautiful. Okay, but this episode is starting to run a little bit long. So what I'm gonna do is explore all of this in the next one. If you guys enjoyed, please like. And comment, subscribe for more. I do try to bring one of these every single day. Hopefully, we'll be moving on tomorrow. In any case, I'll leave you guys off here and catch you in the next episode. Bye.